Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In this lesson, we will explore the skill set you must acquire to create basic documents with the WordPad program in Windows 10. While you will certainly have more flexibility in creating documents when using a more sophisticated program like Microsoft Word, WordPad is included with Windows 10 to give all users basic document creation ability. This will also introduce you to some of the basic skills in word processing on a computer. You will learn how to create new documents, open documents you have created, edit text, save changes, and close documents. First, though, you must start the WordPad program. To open WordPad in Windows 10, click the Start button in the taskbar to open the Start menu or the Start screen. Then click the All Apps button in the navigation pane to display all of the apps on your computer. You can find the WordPad app under the Windows Accessories app group within the listing. Click the app icon to start WordPad. If you prefer, you can right-click the app icon and then either click the Pin to Start or Pin to Taskbar buttons in the pop-up menu that appears to pin the app to either location for easier access in the future. Once you open WordPad, you can instantly begin creating a new document by typing on your keyboard into the document window. In Windows 10, you can click the File tab in the ribbon and then click the New command in the drop-down menu that appears to create a new WordPad document if needed. Within the WordPad document, the blinking cursor shown on screen indicates where the text that you type into the document will appear. When the cursor comes to the end of a line, the text will wrap automatically down to the next line. Only when you want to begin a new paragraph is it necessary to press the Enter key on your keyboard. Holding down the Shift key while pressing one of the alphabetic keys will make uppercase characters. Holding down the Shift key while pressing one of the number keys will make the symbol listed at the top of the number key. You can delete characters to the left of your insertion mark by pressing the Backspace key. You can delete letters to the right of the insertion mark by pressing the Delete or Del key on your keyboard. You may also delete text by clicking and dragging over it to select it, and then pressing the Delete or Del key on your keyboard. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.